Hey guys, it's CJ from SmartKTAP.com. We're here at Corning's booth at CS2014, checking out the anti-microbial uh, Gorilla Glass. And Shantana is going to tell us all about it. That's right. So this Monday we have this exciting news. We launched uh, the Corning Antimicrobial Gorilla Glass. Um, this is the first antimicrobial cover glass that has been uh, registered with the EPA, the United States Environmental Protection Agency. Um, we are doing here uh, some demos at CES uh, to demonstrate to the consumers um, the kinds of contamination levels that they may have on their phones. So we are using something called an ATP meter. It's simply a, a swab that is used to wipe off and get a sample of contaminants that may be on your phone, may or may not be, right? So we're doing this uh, little test to see what we can pick up off your phone and what exactly does that mean. So the product has been designed to incorporate uh, small amounts of ionic silver, and that is the active agent in the glass. This active agent is built into the into the glass. It is not a film. It is not a coating. This ionic silver is released at very trace amounts to the surface of the glass and then interacts with whatever organic contaminations, contaminants that you may have on the surface. So. I am uh, doing this ATP test. ATP is an indicator of organic residue. It could be any kind of residues, dead skin cells from your face. It could be food particles that you picked up while you were eating and typing at the same time. Um, or it could be um, microbes of some kinds. Um, so now I'm going to use this ATP meter. Um, I released an agent into this uh, sample that I picked off your phone. And I am getting, in 15 seconds, we'll have a reading. It'll be a readout of the amount of ATP that was picked up, and it'll be an indicator of the kinds of organic contamination you may have. So, your number is basically 500. We are taking a pic, uh, sort of a little mini survey here. Uh, not a very scientific survey at this point of time, but it's a very simple way of raising awareness of the kinds of uh, uh, micro uh, kinds of contamination that you might pick up on your surface. 500 number will put you into what we are calling the moderate levels of, uh, of contamination. As you will see, a large number of our uh, volunteers have, who have volunteered their phones are falling within that range. Uh, just to give you a reference point, uh, these kinds of products, these ATP meters are used to measure hygiene, uh, surface hygiene levels in a wide variety of industries, hospitals, food packaging, food processing industries. And there, their reference point is about 30. So regardless, most people who have come and volunteered their phones this morning and this afternoon and through the show have been far exceeding that number. So this is our way of uh, showing that uh, there are um, the opportunist, uh, opportunity for picking up a range of contaminants on your phone by sheer touch. Uh, we like to think of our personal devices as truly personal, but they really aren't that personal because we touch a large variety of surfaces. When we touch, we bring those interactions right back on our surfaces. When we touch our face, 15.5 times. Mouth, nose, eyes, 15.5 times an hour. So what we bring on our surfaces, we also bring very close and intimate to our, ourselves. Therefore, we feel like an op the, the, there is an opportunity for us to improve upon the, the product that we already designed, which is uh, and, and have offered to the world in two billion devices. Uh, we have um, anti-gorilla glass and now we have anti-microbial gorilla glass as well.